you took the one thing Mr. Serene needed to survive, Dr. Amaral. That made you priority one. Yeah, they made that clear. Monarch lined every escape route with barricades, roadblocks. I had to get to the mainland, but I couldn't do it by car. Needed a new plan. All right, let's go. Beth, I think I'm gonna need a ride. The streets are too hot. All right, where do you want me? I'll let you know as soon as I find some higher ground and get a good look at the situation on the bridge. I think it might be a no-go. Gotta get to higher ground. be a lot better when you get me on that boat. Monarch's right on my ass. I'm not exactly making friends out here. How's Dr. Amaral? Still kicking and screaming. How long do you need to get here? That depends. Let me check. <laughs> better get inside before the chopper spots me. looking for a viewpoint. So, we don't know where he is. We can't, uh, we can't find him. So we need to look into a, you know, a, uh, a replacement. All ponies are made of butter in night springs. Ah! Two things happening in Gidu of Niget Springs. Thank you. All ponies are made of butter in Night Springs. We know the old dance, the for um, fortunate and the destitute. The haves and the haves, have nots. Those who dine at the table and those who starve in the street. But the tables can be over. Uh, the, uh, but the tables can be turned. The gluttonous consumer may find himself the consumable resource. Do that again. And yet, that is the fate that awaits you in Night Fringe. It's Night Springs. Night Cringe. Springs. Bright Night spring. Fright. Wind. Jesus. We know the old dance. The fortunate and the destitute. The haves and the have-nots. Those who dine at the table and those who starve in the street. But the tables can be turned. The glutton is consumed. I 
no visual on Joyce or Wilder. Doing another sweep. should be able to meet me there with the boat. A giant gas sign out front. Can't miss it. It's nice and bright for Monarch to see. There's not a lot of options. Switching to Monarch frequencies. Be in touch soon. I'll be there in a few minutes. Don't stand me up. Okay. All right, Bobby's back, and we're getting reported. Where's the fire pole? We've got a truck driver from Lucky Joe's treasure trove on the line. Greg Lawrence, talk to me. Yeah, I'm out here by Port Donnelly Bridge. You bastards.
Doc. He may try to escape by water. Shit. HQ? The civvies heard gunfire. They're freaking out up here. Beth, change of plans. The pier's too hot. I'm gonna find another way across. I'm almost there. Just wait two minutes. I'm not putting Dr. Amaral at risk. I'll make it across that bridge. Whatever it takes. I need to get up to the bridge. Cross it.
Okay, good. That's cool. Just gotta make it across the game bridge into the stair. This is so bad. I knew I'd be dead if the stutter collapsed while I was in the frozen crash. I had to reach solid ground and the deck of the cargo ship was my best bet. I just had to find a way down. I had to reach solid ground and the deck of the cargo ship was my best bet. Just had to find a way down. Frozen crash was a mess. Somehow, I had to find my way across. Hope for the best. I kept heading downwards, towards the cargo ship. The route down wasn't exactly user-friendly.
fracture was getting much worse. Timelines getting scrambled. Caught in violent loops, off sync. Crashing into each other. This was what the end of time would look like. Everything was broken. In chaos. Frozen. And no one would know. Okay. Nice boat. Hold still. Hold still. Hold still. was escalating. Objects were moving out of time, out of order, entire timelines overlapping. And it was going to get worse, unless we could stop it. You don't understand the power you're wielding. You need to hand this technology over to Monarch. I've prepared for what happens next. You say you're prepared, but no part of this plan of yours involves stopping it from happening. Even if I fix William's machine, what could you possibly hope to achieve? The end of time is coming. There's no way to- Hey! This isn't a debate. I just watched a ship fast forward through a fucking bridge. Time is running out. And the fracture's getting worse by the minute. And it cannot be stopped. Paul has been to the end of time. He's witnessed it firsthand. Can't you see? We've prepared for what's next out of necessity. Your research is based on work by William Joyce. You respected him. He knew that the fracture would occur, but he also knew that it could be fixed. Will built a way to stop the fracture. This. The countermeasure. We're traveling to the past to retrieve it. You can help us get there faster. Or... You can agree to disagree. I'll have to run diagnostics on the machine. I can't promise anything before that. Nick, take Amaral to the machine. Keep an eye on her. You got it. Welcome to the team, Doc. Don't make me shoot you. <laughs> 